Richard Johnson, that was uh, a tough day at the office for Middlesex. How important was the toss this morning? Yeah, very tough day. Uh, coming to the game, obviously, in, in good form. Uh, last three games, we played really nice uh, cricket. Uh, the last game actually, you know, felt more the all-round game that we were looking to put together. Uh, so yeah, full of confidence here, obviously. Um, and we found it, obviously, you know, pretty tough uh, first up. Ball moved a little bit. Um, we knew it was a used wicket, so we knew it was gonna, not going to be easy and free-flowing. Uh, we understood that before the game. Obviously, it was a, a tough surface to, to get in on. Um, we lost a few early ones, and then it just you know, obviously got tough as the, as the innings went on. And you know, you, you're facing a very good bowling attack, a couple of international bowlers on that, obviously. So disappointed that we didn't adapt to get what we thought was probably a pass score around the 180. Um, so disappointing we didn't get those extra 50, 60 runs with another partnership here and there. Um, but all in all, when you're only chasing 135, 133 or whatever it was, um, you know, if you, if you can see off the new ball, um, which they did pretty well, uh, you, you need to be taking wickets early. We had a car, we had a good shout for an LBW that wasn't wasn't given. Um, so yeah, it, look, disappointing day. Obviously, we, we we came in feeling like this was a game we could win and and, and and you know try and really push through to the last game to try and qualify. I'm guessing you'd have bowled first as well. I think either way, it doesn't really matter whether you the bowl or, or, or bat. You, you know that 180. If you can put runs on the board, I think it, you know if you can get 180 on there, I think it's going to be hard to chase. So it it wasn't really one way or the other. Uh, we probably would have had a bat, but it didn't matter either either way or, or bowl. Sorry, but it didn't really matter either way. We knew if we could bat and get 180, we, we were in the game, and it's quite hard to chase then on a wicket like that. As I said, if you don't take, make early inroads and you're only chasing 130, then the game game's a bit easier. Obviously a used wicket, I think it was the third, maybe fourth time it was used, so that's obviously difficult for yourself, the groundsman, um, to be able to secure match, but 6,000 here today, I guess you'd be disappointed that that was the surface. Yeah, I think everyone's disappointed that the game didn't didn't go through to the end and that we weren't victorious. I, I, I understand, you know, here it's very difficult, they don't have a lot of a wickets, so we, we're, we're used to sort of coming back on, on some used wickets and stuff, so we, we understood that before the game, so that's not an excuse, we, we, we get that, we understand it, we just got to make sure that we, you know, we get that 180 that we think is a, is a score that we can defend. Off the back of Lancashire's say it'll be disappointment because it was building to something for Middlesex, wasn't it, but as you say, it kind of came grinding to a halt with that, the start of the innings. It is disappointing because it felt after obviously the start of the comp where we didn't play very well, um, we got our stuff together over the last three games, played really nicely and as I said the last game I think was the one that we started to really put a, a proper all-round performance in and, and then to come and, and, and you know struggle on this on, on a slow wicket, um, yeah it was, it was yeah, it's disappointing. The, that change room is extremely disappointed in that performance. How crucial, though, is the comeback from those first two games for the team going into the remainder of the season? Because it could have been a competition that went the wrong way and then all of a sudden you're limping into the championship. But is it important to put the first hour today, the first 90 minutes today, to one side? Yeah, look, it can happen in cricket and unfortunately it happened to us today. We'll go to Merchant Taylors on Wednesday trying to win that game of cricket, uh, try and play our best cricket again. You're right, you know, momentum can play a part, but... We also know once we move into our championship um, part of the summer, we're in a good position in that. Uh, we've played some really good cricket all year in that, so we won't let that affect us the way we go into that. But there was a danger after those first two games. It could have gone badly wrong. It didn't, and that is a positive. Yeah, it's, it shows good spirit amongst the boys. Um, I think the way we try and run things, the way we do things, is we don't get too high when we're winning games of cricket. So the last three games, we've, we've stayed very level and we've talked about how we can be better. When we don't win games of cricket, we don't get too low, but we talk about how, how we can be better again. And, and, and hopefully when you keep level and you don't get too emotional about things, you can, you can come back quicker and, and, and put performances on uh, after you know, losses or, or, bat or poor performances.